Welcome back everyone, Happy New Year! Today we're going on a trip to Portland back to Sydney uh, with Emirates on the A380-800 and it's going to be a long one today, 14 hours again and check out everything and compare the experiences Alright everyone, everyone, welcome to DXB, uh, it's about 5 o'clock and now we're just going to head over into the economy departures area and uh, check in. It's a bit early, but let's see if the service is good. Heading in, we can see it's pretty busy here at DXB, but nonetheless, I'm going to check in the bags and uh, head on over to security. So, just checked in. I had to pay for the oversized luggage. It was about $400 just for like 6 kilos, so it was quite a lot of money for that. And now we're going to head up with security. So we're just going to go over to the gate, which is at the A's, which is a different um, area, and we're going to be catching a train. So we just passed security, and now we're going up to the gate by train. After arriving at the A block of the Terminal 3, you can see that we're going through some of the shops. And we're just going to be taking a lift downstairs. And there are lots of great facilities here. There's been included lounges, more different uh, partner um, airlines and everything. There are a lot of uh, shops, um, G3, and all kinds of luxury goods. It's probably one of the most rich uh, airports in luxury products. This is the duty free shop. One of the uh, one of DXP's largest duty free shops, I think the only one, and this is the famous capital. That's about sixteen thousand US dollars. Some sweets. Luggage, books, lifestyle, technology, clothes. So, um, this is a. I'm right here now in like a lounge, and I'm just gonna be doing a bit of work. And uh, soon, uh, in about an hour, we'll start the boarding and head downstairs over to the gate. Uh, it's not too far from here, we just took a train that you saw before. There were some problems with the baggage with Emirates because today is new, I think they're doing some like different um, regulations. Uh, I'm not sure what's going on, but with the baggage there were some issues. Um, so I also wanted to check for upgrades, like to do business class. It was about 4,000 Australian dollars per person, which is I think excessive. Given that on the app there were special offers which now seem to have gone, so not doing that. And um, I'll give an update when it's time for board. So we just left the lounge and now we're heading up to the gate. So I heard that they're born in early today for some reason because of the New, Year, uh, New Year's Eve. Um, so I just arrived at the gate early. So we just uh, used the automatic gate and now we're going downstairs um, to the gate. 
So we just arrived at the gate and now the jet bridge is on the view and we'll be boarding very shortly. We are boarding now. One of the first batch just born after the first business club. Welcome on board. Some of the seat features are basically the same from last time. Um, tray table, uh, these seats, they go like that. It's basically. Yeah. Six bound to Sydney. Uh, joining me in the uh, flight deck is uh, Captain uh, Karim Sharif uh, from Canada and uh, also uh, the senior first officers today we have uh, Carillo and Louise for the present. Your person today, uh, Simon, uh, will hand over the cabin. He's assisted by Captain Zul Riser in uh, Business class is faith and an economy is charity. Welcome the of the crew will look up safety and comfort. So basically this is the entertainment system ICE which is uh, now featured on most of all of uh, Emirates newer planes which has all the extensive movies, features, um, entertainment information and all of that. It's probably one of the most extensive uh, entertainment systems because it has everything on it. Hi everyone, welcome to the laboratory. I'm going to show you some of the cool features here. So, Mule Service hasn't kicked in yet, and this is really because the Airbus A380 800, it's not the newer model, you know, with the premium economy. It only has economy, uh, business at first, so there isn't really at the front of the plane premium. So, I was able to go at the very front of the plane with the cockpit and with these toilets are, and they're much, much better than the ones at the back of the plane. Let's check out some of the things. So, the food service took a very long time. It's a beef plus one curry and I'll put you on my thoughts. I'm gonna try the plus one curry. It's okay. A bit spicy actually. Try the sauce.
so they started serving the breakfast. Uh, it's like a scrambled eggs with the baked beans and some like that potato. And um, it's almost time for leaving. It's about one hour and a half. And I'm gonna get some balls and meals. This is the fresh fruit. Then I'm gonna try the scrambled eggs. It's very salty. Try the baked beans. And the potato. I've had better meals for Edwards, but it's all too bad. So they just serve this towel, it's very cold, so I think they, they should really reheat them. A glass flight was much better than towels, so it's something disappointing for this flight. <laughs> Watch this video.